Howdy folks, Sean here from Hiking with Sean on YouTube. And today I am just got off work, thought I'd do a little hike to balance myself out a little bit. It's midway through the work week. And uh, if I don't get out at least one day through the work week, even though it gets dark really quick, I just, I get really grumpy. <laughs> so uh, today I'm out hiking and you can see by the beginning of the video new pack um got this pack sent to me and the folks who sent it to me said if i like it do a review video for it not getting paid to make this video just want to make that clear right away um but i tested it out um i tested it out off camera make sure that i wasn't going to review something i didn't like um and so far i like it and i'm gonna tell you why so out here in the woods sun's going down can't hike for too long but at least i'm getting out right that's the important thing um this pack is called total pack it is a amazon only um i think you can only buy it from amazon i will include a link down to this pack below it's not an affiliate link or nothing like that i'm not getting paid or anything like that it's just a straightforward link to this uh company or this product mind you so it's pretty cool uh, I would consider this a backpack for using for day use hiking if you're going on a short hike or to go to school with or go to work with if you carry a backpack for that or even like if you're wanting to go on a bike ride and you want to take a, a lightweight pack with you or even a, a carry-on if you do a lot of air travel I really don't air travel yet maybe one day but a uh, total pack is the brand name and there you go that's what it looks like this thing is really lightweight i think it's 11 ounces when it's uh unpacked holds up to 35 liters and has about 11 different pockets and as you could tell from the uh, beginning of the video it packs really small um that's what i really liked about it when i first got it i got it packed like that and i thought was this a fanny pack you know what is this thing and then i unzipped it and pulled out a backpack and i thought what, what a good concept what a cool design and as you could tell today all i really wanted to bring was my uh g7x camera in case i see something i want to take a picture of some gatorade or powerade for, for the drink uh beef jerky and of course my first aid kit just in case i need it and i also brought my phone which is nice because there is a usb port connected to this backpack you have to provide your own charging brick which you could plug in and, and put in the backpack on the inside and then you got to provide your own cord for your phone obviously mine's an iphone and i got my iphone sitting in there Ch should be charged by now i uh, didn't really have a whole lot of charge left i think that's convenient i like seeing that now with that being said this is the kind of pack um, i wouldn't throw in the washer or dryer it's something i would like wash down with a sponge try to protect that area um, i don't know how long it'll last it looks pretty strong looks like it's pretty good and the way it's positioned it looks like it's it'd be fairly waterproof like that um it's it's really good material it's kind of like a rip stop material really lightweight that's what i like about it the zippers and the uh little straps and everything seem like they're really uh strong and it's really lightweight it's a cool lightweight pack i have other day packs that i like more than this but i'm really really into hiking as you could tell <laughs> 300 and something videos you know 350 plus videos um i would recommend this for a short day hike for any day hiker especially if you don't want to spend a lot of money on a pack like I have. I I think this retails for $21, $22. It's under $25. You can get it in black, uh, gray, blue, and of course orange. I bought orange because I think it looks cool and plus if it's hunting season, it's more visibility. That's why I got it.
Alrighty, folks. So that is my little review of the Total Pack system, or the Total Pack backpack. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, I do recommend this product if uh, if you're looking for something lightweight, pretty durable, um, and cheap for like a day hike, a short day hike adventure. I I'd get it. Um, I wouldn't suggest it for overnights. I don't think there's a enough capacity of the bag to carry everything you need unless you're doing maybe like a, a lightweight overnight or a ultra light as they call it then it may be a good option because like i said it's 11 ounces uh without anything in it i haven't weighed it personally i don't have a, a scale that's something i need i guess i need to invest in to really see how uh, heavy my packs are <laughs> but it, it feels light and even with a first aid kit a camera um gatorade bottle beef jerky the power brick on my phone and all that stuff it, it, it still feels really light i can barely tell it's back there um i really like that and it's comfortable you know i want something comfortable i was given a pack the other day just you know because someone didn't want it it's like an army ruck, rucksack type thing pretty cool design just very uncomfortable probably going to give that to someone else <laughs> but uh i do recommend total pack if you're looking for uh, an affordable backpack that you can really use for anything whether it's hiking day hiking um ultralight hiking backpacking or biking jogging um school work air travel whatever um i recommend it so that's thing folks anytime i get a hold of a product that i don't like you will never see a video for it unless i buy it first and want to review it and then show you an alternative then then i'd do it but i, I never lie Whew, my hands are kind of cold it's like 40 degrees um i kind of see my breath of course it's getting colder now that the uh, sun is going down but uh it's cold but it's supposed to be like the warmest day of the week i was going to do it yesterday but it was sleeting <laughs> it's not bad out here there's nothing on the ground so they've had some sunshine um but yeah that's my review if you want to check out total pack like i said link down in the description below it's not an affiliate link i'm not getting paid for it um i'm just reviewing a product that was sent to me so and I, and I enjoy doing that so if companies are watching and you want me to do that send it on over just keep it kind of related to this i've had some people contact me about like power tools and stuff i, I, don't, I don't use power tools <laughs> so you know i had to kind of say no no thank you i don't know anything about power tools um but yeah so check out the link check out the pack like i said it's under 25 bucks not bad for a pretty good lightweight pack and it's a different company than all the the big name cheap companies you know it's something cool and new to to check out i think i like finding about all about all these different companies and whatnot so thanks again for watching if you like this video hit that thumbs up button feel free to comment down below tell me what you thought of uh me reviewing this pack let me know if if you think i'm getting better at reviewing stuff or if i need to work on stuff <laughs> um I, the whole time i was showing off the pack i was talking and i didn't have the mic on didn't want to do all that over again i'm losing daylight um so that's why you could see all the little um words and stuff come up share this video with others especially on social media if you really enjoyed it that really helps out when you all do that and it'll help the company out for people who are interested in total pack and a pack like total pack at least and if you're not a subscriber to my youtube channel please hit that subscribe button today it's free it motivates me to keep making videos keep reviewing stuff keep finding unique items to take with you on your hikes and uh you know it's cool because i never knew hiking with sean would ever get to this point so you know please subscribe and i'm also on social media facebook twitter instagram just look up hiking with sean you'll find me 
feel free to follow and like and subscribe to them elements as well so thanks again for watching another episode of hiking with sean and until next time i'll see you on the trail Whew. one hand is like frozen <laughs> this is a cool pack i'll uh probably test it out on my bike rides like tunnel hill it'd be perfect for carrying everything i never it's like i never bring the right pack with me i, I use this old camelback that's not very uh big and i try to bunch everything up into it it just never works out i think i'll probably start using this backpack primarily for my tunnel hill rides it's pretty nice so you'll probably see it around on them videos